Hey, I got a quick video for you. It's going to be how to sharpen a knife with a buddy guard by Sharpal. And then I'll also be using the Hutzel's leather strop. So, I'll show you the knife we got here. It's going to be a Milwaukee. This is a uh, the Hardline D2 steel, and it is pretty dull. If uh, the blades rolled over, you can see it right there a little bit. Got a couple rollover spots, one there, the front here. So, buddy guard is 325 on the rough side, and I believe this is 1200 on the smooth side. So, get your angle. work it away and with the same pressure hold your same angle and then come back at you now when you're first starting out just try to maintain your angle take your time as you get better, you know, you could pick up the pace. Now I'll switch to the smooth side. And then you'll start to see you'll be able to notice that you'll start to clean up the blade real well and this is when you go to the smooth section of the stone is when you'll actually get sharp and then you'll be pretty nice at that point and then the stroke will get you to the point or the strap will get you to the point where you become razor sharp. Alright, so after you're done with the stone, you're going to take the strap. And you will be going away with the blade. Don't come down this way because you'll cut your leather. So you're going to be going like so. Hold your angle. Come back on the leather. This is coated with so this will give you a little more micro abrasions on your blade. Um, this is called like the strop compound, or it's got a couple different names, but a lot of the times it will come with. Can look it up there's all different ones
that's the basics. Hold on a second. Check that blade out. Alright, so my surface was a little too dry. So as with the Hutzel's uh, instructions, you lightly moisten your fingertips and then apply a little bit of olive oil to the surface. So that is just basically about two drops of olive oil smeared right over the top. Looks like it's a lot more than it really is, but definitely not. Just only a tiny little bit. And then you're going to continue. Working the blade. So afterwards, we'll do a test cut, some paper, some cardboard. So hopefully this was helpful. Remember, uh, do the olive oil beforehand. I gave it a couple, couple of goes and then I forgot about it. 